So we've all had that experience where we're working with somebody and they just literally are so far out of balance. You know, athletics is all about balance. Speed, everybody wants to hit them further and they're just, they're not even close to in balance. I want to introduce you to the balance rod. Uh, we've had a balance rod for several years. We've completely redesigned it. Ballistic nylon, fl flat back so it doesn't slide around. It's kind of, uh, has kind of, the, the knobs on the fabric kind of keeps me in place. I can fold it, it's easy storage. I can set up different stances, it's really good. But here's the deal. When I use it with my students, I, there's no way that you and I can feel what they're feeling when they almost topple over. We can't do that. If we put the balance rod in play for them, let them stand on it while they're kind of getting set. You're teaching stance or you're teaching any kind of a swing. We, they kind of stand on it right in their insteps. They're going to look at you kind of funny. Their toes and their heels should be on the ground, but just barely. We put a sense of imbalance into their setup, right? and their body is wanting to make adjustments to keep them in balance so they don't topple over, which is what you and I want them to do too, right? We want to make the swings not falling down. Then we kind of let them start to make motions, and you and I can watch as their toes and heels get a little wiggly, right? But if they do that, maybe 15 or 20 swings, they're going to get a sense, their body is going to begin to make adjustments. Wow, it's amazing. They're going to make adjustments where those toes and heels stay in place. Full swings, absolutely. You're going to go left toe, right heel with a big back swing. You're going to deliver impact, right toe, left heel. But, but the body is going to be centered and balanced all the time. That's where speed comes from, right? Where my body's not trying to compensate and figure out what's going on. The balance rod is really going to help that as we do it. One other thing I want you to see, and, and if you've got somebody who's given it this motion here, which we all do, we put everything under their feet. We put golf balls and wood planks, whatever. Stick the balance rod in like this, I cannot get outside my right knee. If that's all it was for, it would be fantastic. It's awesome. So put the balance rod in your, in your teaching kit, toss it out there, let them warm up with it virtually every day. Here's the crazy part. When I get off, I mean, even as I say this right now, when I get off the balance rod, it's like somebody poured concrete into my feet. They don't want to move out of balance. It's a terrific tool that way.